Welcome to the Map Editor Guide. This tutorial is divided into three parts, layout, features, and visuals. In this guide, we'll walk through creating a competitive and visually polished map using Frost Giant Studio's new alpha version editor. Let's begin by creating the foundation. We set the map dimensions, Select the Sigma Arctic tile set and choose the terrain layer. Floor tiles large. The base cliff level is set to 4 with shallow water enabled and we activate the day night cycle essential for storm gates. Once done, we confirm and generate the map. We now shape terrain using tools like flatten raise one and deep void. Deep void creates impassable low ground. We start designing the main base using command posts. As a rule of thumb, a 4x4 grid of command posts defines the minimum viable base size, though 5x5 or 6x6 is recommended. Next, we start working on natural expansion area. The main base is raised to high ground, with a ramp connecting it to the lower terrain. We form the center of the map, a storm gate placed on low ground. This makes for a three-tier layout. Main base on high ground, natural at lower level, and storm gate below both. Finally, we surround the playable area with deep void, isolating it as an island. Now we place Luminite and Therium near the bases. A helpful note, Luminite should be placed 5 squares from the command post, and Therium 8 squares away from the main base. This ensures balanced early game resource collection. Now we begin painting the terrain, adding snow layers over the metallic layout. We place destructible trees that, when cleared, open a side path towards the map center and towards the wellspring, a healing fountain for nearby units. as well as layering different terrain textures. Next is the most time-consuming part, polishing the visuals. We add doodads and props. Doodads that bring detail and story to the environment. This includes refining terrain color and enhancing the overall visual identity of the map. Here's the final result, a complete and visually refined competitive map. Thank you for watching this map editor guide. I hope it helped you in your first steps with our map editor.